Hello. Happy Friday. How are we all? So I'm just checking to make sure I am alive. I don't know why I've got three things come up on my thing. But... Hey, how are you? How are we doing? Are we having a fab Friday? Let us know in the comments. Um, yeah, we need to clean up some brushes. Let's do that quickly while I'm... So if you have been scrolling and you've just come across Mathis, my name is Pauline Rogers and I am a brand manager with Unique. I've been with Unique for five years this month, guys. Nearly my anniversary on the 17th of Unique. So if you are seeing me and you've got the live in the corner, then come and say hi by pointing hello, hi girl, hi Pauline, good afternoon. Whichever way you do your greetings, or if you if you're actually watching me now and it's not in your, you're not in here, you're not in the UK, and it's your evening or your early morning, then put good morning or good evening, whatever time it is in your neck of the wood. Because I forget that how my videos get so far and wide. <laughs> I forget that. So we have got. Let me just carry on what I was doing first. My mind's gone all over the place. We, um, if you're catching this on the replay, that live is not there. But hashtag replay and drop me a heart and let me know that you are there. Let me know that you've checked in so that I can come back and thank you for stopping by. So today's the day, guys. They are here. <laughs> it arrived. So we have got the new shades to our April special. We have got the rose and the peach so i'm going to show you them we have got the photogenic lip stain and we have also got the emerald green feels like an emerald green um liquid liner which i will open up and show you so let's look can you see that can you see it can you see? In fact, let me. On my hand, can you see? So that's the green. We do a black. And we also do. I only need to sort my desk out. I've got so much stuff about balancing on everything else. It's just ridiculous. And this is the blue one. I'll put them side by side so you can see they are different. So this is the blue one. This is the one that came out in our Black Friday. So can you see the blue and the green? So if you're somebody who likes blue liner and green line, you have got, or we've got the black. I don't know where I do it. I don't know my black. I don't know where I've got my black, actually. I know I have got a black one here somewhere. That's not it, is it? I think that's a brow. Yeah, it's a brow one. I don't want to tell my black. I know I've got a black here somewhere. <laughs> or I know I may have done. I may have run it out in the... No, it's another position. Eyebrow liner. So I haven't got the black one here. I thought I had got the black one here, but I haven't got the black one. So I can't show you the black one, but black is black anyway. So that's the green and the blue. So let me get some primer on. And then I can show you, and then if anybody's there, you can say which one you want me to do. If not, we will just go with one of them, and then tomorrow I'll go on with the other one. So how is your Friday panning out? Have you had a good Friday morning? Has your lunchtime been great? Is your afternoon starting well? Have you been at work and you've just come home? Let us know in the comments, guys, what are you up to? So it's a bit of primer on. Okay, so this is the photogenic lip stain. So that's the colour. And you can put that on as light or as dark, depending on how many coats you put on. So we're going to use that one today, so I'm going to show you that one. So we'll leave that to one side. 
and then because you've seen that you've seen the warm tone and you've seen the um cool tones i'll get these out of the box and just try and give me a bit more space because i am running out of space i've seriously got to sort out my table i've got so much stuff on here right so we have got the rose tones they are the rose tones look at them are they not gorgeous my camera doesn't really do them any justice but they are lovely colors they really are vibrant and then we have got the peach tones so they are the peach tones you can see you've got like a an olive green and brown so which one if anyone's watching should i go for peach or rose we've got a while so if anyone comes on then we will go with whichever one's choice in one time let me get a base face on because <laughs> we can't put anything on unless we get a base face and we are going to put my quattro in my pocket to warm up lost the pocket so i'm sitting on it so bb just to go with bb something quick and easy bb 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 and we've used the mattifying primer so i'm not going to have a shimmer today i always drop my lid always drop something don't i getting clumsy in my old age so if you want to know all the specials um, for April, just put April in the comments, guys, and I can shoot you over a list of what is in our special where you can get 20% off. If you want a Shave Match for foundation or BB, put Shave Match or Shade and I can Shave Match you. I'll tell you how I, what I need you to do to shave match you as well and if you want to know about coming on board with us um put beauty box in the comments so i just gonna put them on because i didn't quite have a full pump on that on there i didn't quite do a full pump I'm just stippling this on so bb has got mineral base guys spf 30 in there which is great for the brighter months when we get the sunshine out <laughs> but the uv ray guys is there all the time even when it's cloudy so if you want that extra bit of protection from your foundation then you need the one with the spf in there guys really is going to help okay so that's a quick base base i'm not going to worry too much i'll go focusing too much on the base base because i want to show you these uh, palettes and i'm going to do let me use my bronzer and i'm going to put on some eyebrows with it i'll just highlight my eyebrows because it was weird yesterday i did my quick face yesterday and I didn't even do my brows it wasn't until I actually done the photos and looked back and I thought oh I should have done my eyebrows because they're not quite showing up and just a little bit to make them more noticeable well not so much noticeable but to frame my eyes because your eyebrows do frame your eyes nicely just gives you that framework like so quick and easy done and then we're just going to use a little bit of bronzer to do a quick little contouring because then we are going to do our eye look and then our lip look what i am going to do while well, i remember it a little bit of lip gloss uh, not a little bit of lip gloss 
lip, um, lip mask on because I find if you do want to wear these lip stains, you really want to get your lips in good condition. Because if they're if they if they you know need hydrating, and you put a lip stain on, they're going to sit in your the lip stain is going to sit in your dry, patty areas of your lips, and not look seamlessly. So you could end up with sort of like a lighter and darker shade on your lips. Hence why I've just put on a little bit of lip mask. Because then that's what's going to do is that going to hydrate my lips. You can exfoliate your lips as well. That you know make it easier. But everything you do like that will help when you use a lip stain. Because once they're on, they ain't going to go anywhere. They're there till you take them off with your um, makeup. At the end of the day. It's just a little bit of contouring around my chin, a little bit around my forehead. Okay, so that's the base face done. Right, so I don't see anybody on. I've not seen any comments. I don't see anybody in the window. So I think what we do is we'll save the rows for tomorrow. And we're going to go on with the peach sound good now I'm not quite sure which way around I'm going to use these colors but we will see what we do um, let me just refresh myself hold on a minute because I, I know I've got a graphic not a graphic a photograph of somebody who actually wore these so let me just call it up quickly and have a look just to refresh my mind on which is the best way to go well, there's no, there's no right or wrong way, but I just want to, just want to see. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, we'll do it that way, or the other way, either way. That's all right. Let's have a quick which is So yeah, so we're going to use today the peach. So is that everyone okay with everyone who's on? If there's somebody on who would like to see the other one, just quickly let me know if you want to see the other one. So this is the peach one, if you want to see the rose one. But I think I'll go for that one today. So I'm just going to get my fluffy brush and all nice and clean. And I'm going to go in. First of all, I'm going to take this little sticker off. Which is very much stuck down on the mirror. then I can use the mirror so you've got a nice mirror there quite a big decent sized mirror in here as well okay so we're going to go in with the lightest color first and we are going to use that basically all over our eye because that's going to act as a base Sort of like the undercoat part of the eye so the lightest color you can use as your base and i don't know whether that brush is actually clean because that's coming out quite dark actually let's get a quick clean up really want clean yeah clean brushes guys the importance of clean brushes is very very important And then we're going to go in with the brown. So we're going to go down. So diagonally across, we're going to use the brown. I may have picked up a little bit too much. So we're just going to use this in our transition area at the top. Now, if you've got a hooded eye like myself, go a little higher.
You can see me transition like that. Got a hair tickling my face. Go away. Right, so and then we're just going to get my blending brush. And we're just going to soften that up and blend that. Go away. Ooh. I've got I've got a hair, rogue hair that's annoying, tickling my face. I don't know where it's gone. It's tickling my face. I'm going to end up sneezing if it keeps tickling me. I don't want that. Okay, so we're just blending that out because you can go over a little bit more darker if you want to. You can add to it and take it away like so. And then we're going to go in with the green. And again, we're just going to touch the sides. And we're going to place that on the outer corner. Again, guys, these are highly pigmented as well. So you only need a little bit to go a long way. Less is more. Can you see that? We can add to it. Can you see that? And then do the same on the other side. Matching it up on the other side. That's why I go in with now. I used to go in with do my right eye first. And then try and match my left eye. Now I go in with my left eye first because then I can match up my right eye because being right handed, I find I can do it better that way. So if you're popping on, come and say hi, guys. Let me know you're there. Drop me a heart. And if I give you value or I resonate with you or just entertain you, and you are a very caring person, could you share this? Hit the share button and share it. And come back and put shared in the comments guys to be added into my appreciation jar i actually went through my last month's lives and i didn't see any shared written name anyone written the name should you know, wrote share in the comments guys so if i've missed you for the last month i do apologize but you need to put shared in the comments to be added into the draw guys because i was i just don't know who's who shared okay and then i'm going to use if i can find it i've lost it oh i had it what did i do with it Ooh, uh. okay one of my brushes has decided to go whoopies I don't want that one. I've lost it. I've lost it. Where's it gone? Not there, not there, not there. There it is. So I'm going to use a flat cream brush and I'm going to damp it down with some rose water. And then we're going to pick up the peachy colour. I'm going to pick it up because it's a shimmer. I'm going to pick it up with a damp brush and then pat it on. And by patting it on rather than um, rubbing it on with the other brushes, it's going to make it more concentrated as well. give me that overall shimmer like so can you see that guys i am loving this palette you know if you have trouble thinking well what color goes with what this takes the guesswork out of what colors you need that will go together because they are all complementary to each other to give you that nice pop of shades that look nice and I think this palette will go with any skin tone as well I will try and find some other presenters and customers who have got these with different skin tones 
and try and do a um, collage for you of the palette used by different uh, skin tones just to show you what it looks like on different people just patting that on like that what do you think can you see that let me know in the comments if you can see that nicely so that is the peach tones guys gorgeous colors and then if you feel like you need you need a little bit more green a little bit more of the, the green you can just add that onto the edges just to darken that off a bit Like so and then you can you go you know you can use the green liner as well if you wanted to i'm not going to use the green liner today because i'm scared of you know to be honest guys i'm scared of liners not really had much luck with them so i tend not to use them but i know i should really take you on a journey with me and use a liner so I will at some point learn to use an eyeliner. I don't think I'd ever do like a wig, you know, like a um, a wing because I think I'm a bit too old for that. You know, you've got to go by your um, how you look on whether you want to do the wing look. But if any of you do do a wing look, let us know in the comments, and um, you know, by all means, send me your pictures over in your in messenger because i'd love to see it look at that what do you think guys could you see yourself rocking these colors gorgeous 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 what are we doing what are we doing for time Ooh. right so yeah so that is the peach and then tomorrow i'll show you the um rose so we're going to put a bit of quadra on i'll do that last actually let's take the lip mask off now and show you this gorgeous photogenic lip stain so we've now got five lip stains guys to choose from Wow, that's pink my lips up. Now, if you want it darker, you can go over with a second coat or third coat. I'm just going to have the light. What do you think? So by doing the lip mask first, it's got rid of all my dried um, areas on my lips. It's given, it's made my lips nice and supple, so that the lip stain goes on. Because I find with lip stains, if your lips are dry. You sort of emphasize is it emphasize what was the word i'm looking for but it shows up all the areas of dryness on your lips and we don't want that so that's my eyes and my lips now i'm just going to chuck on a bit of um quadra well not literally chuck it on apply it and then i'll be done it doesn't look like anybody's on again today i seem to be missing everybody i suppose because you're on half term you're probably out and about with your children but if you are watching this on the replay, please put hashtag replay, say hello to me. If you've not seen me before, put hashtag one. But most importantly of all, guys, hit the heart button. Drop me a heart. Hit that um, heart button so I know that you have checked into this video. So I'm just going to put a little bit of quarter on. So this has got two bristles, uh, two sides to the wand, a bristle side and a silicon side. And this has got ingredients that's going to help to nourish your lashes because it's got lash serum, lash primer, 
it has got the um, tubing technology which basically means it wraps around every single lash locking in the lash serum and primer to get to work on your lashes so the more you wear this the more you are going to see the results on your lashes it's a vegan formula vegan friendly formula as well guys it is patent pending by unique so you can't get this anywhere else other than unique so if you want to know more about quattra or about our april special foot lashes for the quattra or any of our lash products april for the list of the april specials beauty box if you want to know more about coming on board with us and shade if you want need help with foundation or bb cream if you need a shade match because even though it was last month it was our complexion products i can still do you up to 25 percent saving guys on complexion products i can do you a personalized shopping link that will have that discount for you We will leave it there for today. So what do you think, guys? Could you see yourself wearing lip shades? Beautiful. So hopefully you've enjoyed that, guys. As I said, if you're popping on, you're watching me on the replay, put hashtag replay. If you've never seen this face before, put hashtag one, so I know you're new. Hit that heart button, guys, and also hit that share button and shared and come back and put shared in the comments so that I can add you into my appreciation jar that's going to be in my appreciation drawer at the end of the month. So that, guys, is two of my April special. And as I said, you have got a choice of a green or a blue liner as well if you want to. So go and enjoy your... Friday and I'll see you tomorrow for another live. Take care. Bye.